Howdy, 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 my beautiful Capricorn. How are you doing, darling? My name is Simply Valka, and today we're going to get into your weekly tarot reading for uh, June, darling, 2022. So Capricorn, if you enjoyed this tarot reading today, be sure to give this video a like and subscribe and check out your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign, Capricorn. Your readings will make a lot more sense when you start integrating more of your chart when it comes to receiving tarot readings on YouTube, darling, all right? So uh, let's just get right into your tarot reading here, Capricorn. Let's see what it is that y'all are currently dealing with, darling, all right? Why is it that my darling Capricorns are dealing with here? Ten of Pentacles coming in here, Four of Wands, as well as the Seven of Swords coming in here. Ooh, darling. <laughs> Capricorn, Capricorn, Capricorn. I see a lot of complications in regards to trying to make certain things, trying to make certain people work out in your life here, Capricorn. I get like problems or it's just like... It's like you're trying to make certain relate. I get for especially for some of you Capricorns like family. All right. It's like you're trying to make certain family relationships working at work out for you. But it's always this sense of where it's just like they want to like self-sabotage. All right. It's the sense of where they always have to complicate things. Right. This gives me very much so that analogy where it's just like you're trying to just make a connection, like have a good relationship with when it comes to your mother, when it comes to your brother or sister or that auntie darling. Right. And for whatever the case is, it's like they can't just be normal Capricorn. Like they always have to find a problem to have with you or just whatever to complicate things what what, what is the situation with this here wheel of fortune coming in here all right so i do see like you know this is kind of like for them it's just like i do see them eventually coming around here capricorn so don't be trying to make this energy work out any more than it needs to all right i feel like they're going to come around when they need to let them self-sabotage darling let them you know let them do their mess if they want to do that mess if they don't want help darling you cannot make them have get that help right it's like you can leave you you can't like in this situation not only can you not lead this horse to water but you can't make it them drink either all right you can tell them where the water source is you can tell them that you want to take them to that water source but if they if they don't want to believe you if they want if they don't want to listen to you then that's just what it is what it is darling all right instead of taking it personally if you are taking it personally or instead of trying to make them see it or what have you just be like you know what it is what it is don't say i didn't try to help you here all right and so what i get for some of you capricorns is like it's this message where it's just like here's your permission if you needed permission capricorn because i know y'all were not asking for it but like here's the permission that you did not need capricorn and not trying to be someone's savior all right just because you know the just because you already know the answer to this riddle to the answer to this problem doesn't mean that you need to say it doesn't mean that you need to help other people get to there all right let them figure them things those things out on their own here capricorn because you got your own hustle going on here all right you got your own life to be managing and speaking of that what is it that's going to be coming towards you guys all right capricorn let's take a look here <clears throat> So we have here the Eight of Cups coming in here, the Queen of Wands, as well as the Page of Cups coming in here. So this is very, really, really fabulous here, Capricorn, all right? Because the Eight of Cups that is coming right in here, this is literally what I was just saying. It's just like you walk away because the Eight of Cups represents walking away from a situation. You know, you, you might put a pin on and be like, all right, you know, when you're ready to receive, when you're ready to connect again, darling, then I'm here. But uh, until then, I'm going to go do my own thing, right? And as that Queen of Wands all right and that queen of wands brings in this page of cups energy which represents new people or new opportunities coming into your life here capricorn all right and so what i see for you guys is like the moment you start realigning where you're investing your energy into like you you're going to be uh bringing forth new opportunity in your life and what is this like let's expound on this page of cups like what does this eight, eight of page of cups represent here six of cups coming in here all right so you're going to be receiving some type of offer all right from this new energy i also get that you're you're going to notice once you start putting more focus on your own energy the very situations that you ended up walking away from where you're just like you know what i'm not going to make you drink this water darling or what have you they're going to be qu quickly coming back right because the six of cups represents cards coming in from the wow uh, not cars represents energy coming in from the past that you have that history with all right so there's that confirmation darling all right things are going to be coming back into balance for you with this justice energy and so i really feel as if like i want to start dabbling into this energy with the page of cups on opportunities that's coming in for you all right so you have the judgment card coming in the high priestess as well as the full energy coming in here oh 
Wow. So what I get for you guys right now, Capricorn, is that as the full energy, you're going to be stepping into a new version of yourself is what I feel. You're going to be stepping into a new version of yourself where you no longer are asking for permission, where you're honoring your thoughts, honoring your intuition with things that you are feeling. And I feel as if spirit's going to be rewarding you big time here. All right. It's the sense for you, Capricorn, where it's just like... I see for so beautifully for so many of you Capricorns, like once you start making time for these new things in your life, once you start making time for just yourself and your own projects and what have you here, like you are going to start noticing like how how blessed you feel here because it's like with this judgment energy i always associate that as spirit taking an active role capricorn when it comes to your life i'm trying to bring things into the physical for you all right this is a lot of healing that i feel like is going to be coming in for you because this is in the reverse i just hold up the cards in the upright darling because why wouldn't i i didn't pay all this money for these tarot cards for you not to see them in the upright knight of wands coming in as well so what I see going on for you guys right now, Capricorn, is that y'all are going to not try to like make that horse drink water. You start disconnecting from that and be like, all right, like, you know, I'll, I'll anytime that you want to come back and ask me where that water is again, darling, I can tell you where that water is, but I'm no longer going to be trying to make you drink it. I'm no longer going to be walking with you on this because you got your own life to live here, Capricorn, right? And by you starting to focus more of your energy on your own hustles, on your own things, Capricorn, I see just new opportunities opportunities coming in for you i see people associated with those opportunities that will come along and help some of those some of you it's going to be someone from the past like a past person that you try to have like a business with or what have you you do have some past energies coming in after they finally mature and they're just like oh capricorn like i'm ready to get back to work i'm ready to be about the business now right um i see for all of you capricorns here it's just like <sighs> Spirit has been just sitting there waiting for you, Capricorn, to receive blessings in your life when for that are just like helpful for most more so just you. All right, Capricorn, I feel like right now you're the type of person that when there's like a wish that you would make or something, it's always like a wish that would benefit everyone else, but not really benefit you. Or maybe it benefits you, but like your intent is more so just being like, oh, I want to help evil like X, Y, and Z person there. And so by you starting to finally receive energy just for yourself, you start noticing a lot of opportunity coming in for you. All right. What I want to be suggesting for you at this time. Yeah, you got the two of cups coming in here, darling. All right. What I want to be suggesting for you at this time, Capricorn, is really start feeding more positivity in yourself here. All right. I get this sense of where you're internalizing too much of everyone else's personal issues. Um, they might have issues with you, Capricorn, but that doesn't mean that there's something wrong with you that you need to rectify. That just is something that they have an issue with your authentic personality. That doesn't mean you need to change your personality. It just means that they need to figure something out to work around that personality with you. You know, either they like you for you or they don't like you here all right i get so much so much energy here capricorn where it's just like you take on everyone else's burdens you start analyzing how people are interacting with you in your life it's like because that horse doesn't trust you enough or doesn't want to go to the water source that you're telling them to you're just like well what's wrong with me why don't they trust me enough to go to that water source why why don't they want to come to me about getting that water it has nothing to do with you they have their own personal issues they have their own struggles that they're going through here all right stop stop beating yourself up here capricorn be kinder to yourself darling because you're taking on everyone else's burdens when those burdens don't need to be even existing for you all right humans are humans and sometimes humans are irrational darling all right and just because those humans are irrational doesn't mean that you need to um make them realize that they're being irrational because i feel like life is going to show to them just like normal for all of us like it, life will always have a way of giving us that wake-up call that we need and showing to us that we need that that where we are at the fault or where we are doing something wrong all right so that's what i get for that capricorn any other, anything else coming your way here <clears throat> seven of cups here temperance energy the magician energy and queen of pentacles here capricorn start asking yourself what it is that you want to be successful at start asking yourself what it is that you personally want to do all right 
some of y'all Capricorns haven't been selfish in a very long time because you're perceiving uh, doing something that you personally like as selfish when that's not the case at all. All right. Start putting more of a focus on your own personal life here and start considering how you want your future to be. Start considering all the things that you want to be dabbling into. Maybe you always wanted to have like your own social media career. I always use that as my analogy. Maybe you wanted to always, you know, whatever the case is. All right. Um, start identifying what you personally would enjoy and i see as if spirits just sitting here patiently waiting for you to identify those things so they can start making the that action happen and you just taking part of that part of that action as well like by you taking you know starting it's like by you starting to take physical action towards the things that you actually personally want to that you personally desire spirit's going to be like seeing that be like oh it's time for us to finally get up off this couch capricorn's finally doing something for themselves let's help them out here and things start coming a lot easier for you all right so that's the tarot reading that i have for you capricorn for this week if you enjoy this tarot reading darling let me know in the comments below give this video a like and subscribe remember capricorn if you want to book a private reading with me my website's linked down below simply welcome Dot com next to my social media is tiktok and instagram both just being simply velka darling but uh yeah i will be connecting with you my beautiful capricorn sometime in the near future bye darling